Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for once again. I hope you are well and again we are back with another haul video. But in this video, I just mixed everything like drugstore, high end, everything together. I just wanted to show you guys what I got from high end and what I got from drugstore. So yeah, if you're interested, then keep on watching. <laughs> start from high end i have some skincare in front of me some makeup so let's start from skincare but by the way let me know guys if you like this kind of whole video then maybe i'll do in the future more and also if you want to see my fashion haul like what i buy from some fashion website like clothes bag and whatever that means fashion <laughs> let me know maybe i'll do like this video in the future the first one I got from Sephora brand itself and this is their revitalizing booster. This is supposed to be for mark and tired skin and I'm working so I need everything for my tired skin. And this one also claimed really good one. They say in just 14 days it smooths the skin and diminishes sign of fatigue which is good one. Not only this, it is also volunteer tested. They tested on 24 volunteer for 14 days. So it is a very big claim. So I think this is going to work on me. And yeah, must try. So, all right, the second one I got from Mario brand. This is the aloe vera rose water spray, which I really, really like. I also used one before. This one you can spray in your face anytime you want before makeup after makeup anytime it have really really refreshing smell to it like oh, this rose water smell is really really nice i love this smell and this one have aloe vera this one also supposed to smooth your skin and hydrate your skin and you guys know i have a dry skin so hydration is must needed so yeah and you can also use this in your hair it's extra benefits okay now the expensive one which is clam glue we all know they are super expensive this is the mini one and it cost me 100 something in ringgit but if you go with 50 gram one 15 gram one then it will be 15 yeah 15 gram one then it will be 200 something which is expensive so i'll go with the mini size because it's my first time i don't know if it will work with me good or no so i just went to the mini one this is just a mud mask this is supposed to clean your face and uh, let me check this is supposed to clean your face brighten and soften your skin complexion so i really wanted to try this and i heard a lot of good stuff about this bad boy so must need to try this so finally i got one if i like it maybe maybe i'll be able to spend all those money for the bigger size maybe all right next one from drunk elephant this is their rise and glow this is a tool but you guys need to see how small these two are like oh Hello. okay this is so tiny by me they're super small like my one finger the first one is b hydra this one have pineapple ceramide pro vitamin b5 so this is supposed to hydrate your face and you can mix it with any kind of serum oil or face cream that is this you are recently using so yes anything else i'm missing these both do have like powerful antioxidant that firm and brighten your skin so i'm all about brighten my skin i love brightening product and i love hydrating products so i always wanted to try this too so if i like it obviously i'm going for a bigger size because also about drunk elephant i heard a lot of good stuff so i'm super excited to try this out i'll update you guys how it works in my skin if you don't follow me on instagram please try to do follow because there i update everything that i am not able to update in youtube so follow me there all right the next one is from glow recipe this is the watermelon sleeping mask oh my god you guys oh, 
I hear it also a lot about this from Jeffrey, from Jacqueline. I love them and they love this. So I was like, girl, you need to try this. And I love actually sleeping mask. This one also supposed to work overnight and give you that baby skin effect. This is really liquidy. Like, you can see, this is super liquidy. And this smell really fresh not exactly watermelon watermelon but it smells so fresh so i hope this one works with me because i love the packaging i love the color it's so cute and i hope this works with me all right the next one from ole hendrickson i love their eye cream and this is a duo for their eye cream and brightening moisturizer i use their eye cream before and i love it i love the way it make my under eyes soft brighten i love it and i also really excited to try their brightening moisturizing cream as you know i love brightening moisturizing cream so i hope also this one work with me and the last one i ordered this is from dr jerry this is just a brightening solution face mask again another brightening so yeah i want to just try this i'll try it and i'll let you know guys how to work with me so we are done from skincare now we will move to high-end makeup Alright, so in high-end makeup, the first thing I'm going to show you guys that I got recently, I'm not going to talk about it at all, I'm not going to do anything, I'm just going to show you because this one, this one just I'm going to show you, this one literally deserve a dedicated video and I will do that. Oh my god, I'm super uncomfortable about my lips. Let me know you guys what you think about my lip color because this is literally not my comfort zone. I'm out of my comfort zone and by the way if you guys thinking about this look then check out my instagram because i just filmed a video on this look and i'll be posting the video soon in my instagram so check that out if you want to know how to achieve these eyes or a whole look then go to my instagram all right the one i'm super excited that is anastasia foundation and i also got their loose setting powder i am super excited i know i'm late I know everyone by now posted their video i'm late because i ordered it like sephora online and i ordered not in malaysia i ordered from us so it took really long time to reach to me um but it's okay i'm gonna test out anyway maybe you guys will like my opinion so i'm gonna do a video so it's going to show you this too i also got okay the next one i got from huda beauty and this is a huda beauty foundation you guys i can't imagine my makeup collection without this foundation this foundation make my skin literally look like a model it's smooth nice full coverage i love this freaking foundation so i just ran out from my last one so i had to get another one so i also got that and if you guys don't know i'm in the shade brown sugar so yes all right guys the next one is really really special because this is my dream to get it and finally i got it and this is the none other than hourglass well primer guys i was looking forward to buy this primer forever forever but this guy is freaking expensive so i had to really wait to buy it and finally finally i got it i never wanted to get the travel size i always wanted to get the at least a medium one and this is what it is right the next one also very special and same the way i feel for it i'll let it feel for the next one because this is also from hourglass and this is their vanish foundation this is the foundation stick that everyone once was talking about it this is their stick foundation and this one also freaking expensive like 200 bucks for this one but i'm happy that finally i got it i am super excited and i hope also i love it like everyone else and i got in the shade umber natural umber and i think i think it is my shade a bit dark a little bit dark but i think it's okay i can make it work with concealer and every single thing but i'm really really happy for this too because finally i got it i know maybe i'm a bit traumatic right now but i'm excited all right then next one also is special because it's out there from quite long and this is kind of like my old love you know what i mean because when it came out first time i always wanted to get it but for some reason i couldn't so last boxy charm they 
put this palette and I was like, oh, I have to get it and I got this. And this is the Too Faced Face Palette. This is their blush, highlight and bronzer palette. Guys, I love Too Faced packaging. Like not only this, I love any of their packaging and this one out of the packet that I love. I literally fall in love with it. Like, this is so gorgeous. So cute, so gorgeous and it feels really luxurious. You guys all know this palette by now. This is like simply uh, oops, a bronzer, highlighter, and blush palette. And I also love the colors. Nothing I hate in this palette. I love the packaging. I love packaging so much, guys. Any product that have good packaging, I will go for it, no matter what is inside, how it is, good or not. But if the packaging is good, I'm there. All right, guys, so now the most exciting one. I am so, so, so excited about this one. This is the none other than Morphe Chaffrey Star Palette. Dun, dun, dun. I am so excited, you guys. I'm not going to open this. I'm not going to show it because, like Anastasia, this one also deserves a dedicated video. And I'm going to make a video only using this beautiful palette. And you're going to see that every single thing on that video all right now i'll quickly move to drugstore i have quite uh old new mix like something that is out there from quite 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 long but i haven't used some of them i used and i repurchased them so i'll just quickly talk about it i just don't want to make this video super long so very very quick the first item I want to talk about that I repurchased and I love this is the Maybelline Super Stay 24 hour foundation this is a full coverage foundation you guys all know it I used it before and I really really loved it so I repurchased it again and this one I purchased in the shade honey and golden guys you have to know the shade collection in Malaysia is really sucks like really sucks it's very hard to find mostly in drugstore so hard to find your own shade and this foundation for some reason they have really orangey you know, like super yellowish undertone nothing really worked with me so i always mix up two foundation and yeah i just use golden and honey so this is the first one all right so the second foundation is from revlon and this is also their full coverage 24 hour foundation this is the foundation i mean i know this is out there from quite long but i never ever became able to try this so i just wanted to try it and i got this two shade and one is 405 which is almond and another one is 330 which is natural tan it then the shade difference is really really so much one is 330 and another one is 405 but there is no shade in between in Malaysia at least so I had to take this both maybe I'll mix them together and it will be my shade so nothing to do so you're gonna try all right the second foundation I got is also from Revlon this is their candy foundation this is I think not from so long maybe some month but I also haven't tried and also got their concealer I really hear from people that concealer is really really good one of my friends use it and she really love it and she have almost like same skin like me so I also wanted to try this all right the next item I got from L'Oreal this is their new concealer and this is their infallible full wear concealer and I am in the shade what this is in the shade where is the shade uh, guys oh okay this one is 311 so i don't know if it's my shade or no because i had no tester so i had to just get like you know like get anything that you feel like it can work for you so i just got it hopefully it will work for me so we'll try it out together all right the next one i got from revlon as well this is their cloud lip color this is really really cute you guys i really loved it and i got in the shade pink and another one in peach this is you can use in your lips and also you can use as a blush and i hope i will love it because i really love the packaging it's so cute so we will try it and i'll let you know if i like it or not all right the second one i got 
I mean the next one I got from Catrice and this is their light correcting serum primer and this is one is sunlight this one called sunlight they have two shades another one is like silver really pale for me so this is supposed to be like a serum but it have a little bit glow to it like really subtle glow you can't really see much but I feel like I will love it I don't know I'll try it I cannot say anything now so yes and I also got another two things from Catrice as well and this is their long lasting eye cream this is actually a glitter formula I love when I swatch them guys you need to see how sparkly this one is I don't know how much you can see in the camera but it's super sparkly I really loved it and the second one is like a golden kind of shade this is not glitter it's just like a eye cream cream shimmery like golden silver mixed together so I really want to try this because I love the way they are pigmented and shine I really love this so I'll try this too as well all right and then I got some stuff for makeup revelation you guys know I love makeup revelation I love their foundation concealer or their eyeshadow oh my god they are really really great with very very nice price point all right so what I got is their hydrate primer this one which is really old they are out there from quite long also by now everyone used it but i never so i really want to try this and i also got their new foundation and the concealer that is also their conceal and hydrate foundation i just told you i love anything have hydration thing so i'm have a very 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 high hope about this too i'm also really excited to try this and maybe Maybe I'll make a video while I'm trying as a first impression video. So stay tuned for that. And I also got their Conceal and Define. This is not the first time I'm using it. I used it before a lot of time and I freaking, freaking love this concealer. So I got another one because I finished the last one. I also got the Makeup Revelation Loose Setting Powder in the shade light yellow. I think, uh, not I think, I mean, they are in the same launch in the same time. So. I'm also excited for three of these. I have a high hope and I hope they don't disappoint me. Alright, and the last one is also from Makeup Revelation and this is the collabs with Jackie Jamie and this is the Essence in Spray. Alright guys, finally finished this video. We talked about a lot of this stuff and finally we finished it. I know this video is super long but I hope you guys loved it and if you guys love this video please give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming video from me all right so that's all for this video and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye bye